Today I'm going to do a review on the Sweet 1600 uh, re-release of Frankie's son. So she would be my favorite. Draco Lord and her would be my most favorite out of the Sweet 1600's line. So, let me get on to the doll. She has no tinsel in her hair, but she does have it. Just a little short hair back here. Yeah. She has a purse that is that is the same as her ghouls was it ghouls out? Yeah, ghouls out um purse. Same exact everything. Earrings are stitches. Her makeup is silver at her um silver at the top and blue at the bottom. And it's like a red. Her dress is super pretty. I like to see it. Her shoes are a little different, but it's okay. They're um, just basically blue with stitches on them. Looks like they were sewn together. So that was a simple quick review on the doll. Let me get to her box. Okay, so it has balloons up here with fangs. And it says Sweet 1600. And here's Frankie. And it says Frankie Stein, daughter of Frankenstein. Okay. I'll read to you what it says over here. It says, I have learned two lessons today. The first is that I should never wear a pair of dangling earrings when I'm excited about something totally sparked and melt them down. The second is that it's possible to be as excited for someone else as it is one yourself. And I can't wait to see how much fun Jack Lloyd is going to have at her sweet 1600 birthday party. Oh, that's not again. I guess I should pay better attention to lesson one. So here's Claudine and Jack and Laura. Here's Frankie. And it has a heart with stitches in Frankie. I love the hearts with stitches. It's very cute. She comes with a stand. As you can see, I put, have her on a stand. And somewhere in this box, I accidentally forgot to get her brush out, but somewhere in this box, she has a brush. Um, I think that's all for the doll. So this is my review on Sweet 1600 Frankenstein. Please comment, subscribe, and this is Lucy Bell signing off. Bye. Bye.